people in this project draw on their own experiences from life. They bring a whole lot of movement, they bring a whole lot of energy, they bring a whole lot of, of history. One of the original thoughts that I had uh, drawn this particular story from for Awa was the story of my father who was an engineer and worked uh, throughout the Central North Island on the hydroelectric power schemes. Uh, his journey took him to work in Asia on the Yellow River uh, while he was pursuing his passion for, for engineering and working with a much larger scale project than he had uh, worked with in New Zealand. Uh, his physical health became deteriorated uh, and, and to the degree where one, one evening after work he had a, uh, a very sudden heart attack. Yeah, at the time I, was, uh, I, was, I just happened to be home um, in, uh, in Alexandra and um, my, my mum was with me and my sister and my, my, my brother and, and they kind of all sort of attached themselves to me you know I sort of first had this memory of just this moment in time where I sort of realised that you know dad wasn't coming back and that was that was 20 years ago and this was the point where I was just started to pursue uh, my dance and choreographic career one of the other things that happened when uh, dad passed was uh, this immediate wanting to draw back to where I was from and who I was my journey in dance and choreography was was really what held me together I was it was actually the art form of dance that gave me an opportunity to express my feelings about about that loss and it, it initiated this uh, great desire for learning more about my taha Māori, my Māori side. I uh, began learning my whakapapa, began learning uh, these beautiful stories. I spent a lot of time with my grandmother and she was able to really uh, shelter me, nurture me through this whole time that I was pursuing my dance career and uh, gave me uh, you know, a rock to stand on. Mm -hmm.